Happy Friday everybody, I'm Nino Cafaro and this is your weekly legal update brought to you from my balcony in Ottigia, Sicily. Uh, this is about the 25th take of this video. I had to keep stopping because of all the Vespers and cars going by, but you know what, this is Sicily. There's gonna be Vespers. So we're pushing on nonetheless. And we're only really talk about death and taxes. I thought, well, I'm in Sicily. Uh, Sicilians are a particularly expressive kind of people. So I talked to you about uh, freedom of expression. And we're talking especially about social media. So Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. There was a case I was reading about of a solicitor who was banned for 12 months for posting anti-Semitic comments on their personal Facebook page. Banned for 12 months, 25,000 pound fine. Should be posting those kind of comments anywhere. Anyway, so, uh, but two particular cases that interested me uh, were one where a tribunal upheld the dismissal of an employee for posting particularly derogatory remarks about their employer's products. Of course, it's a personal page, but tribunal said, well, personal page can be shared very easily and the company's damage, uh, reputation could be damaged quite easily. So upheld. Another case, conversely, uh, the dismissal um, was found to be unfair where an employee posted relatively minor negative remarks about the employer's workplace. But listen to us all, just be careful, especially today where everyone is offended very easily, uh, cancel culture, and of course, you don't want to upset your employer. Just be careful what you're posting on social media. If you want to hear more updates from me or perhaps where to find a nice pizza in Ortigia, Sicily, just hit the subscribe button.